Good afternoon. Thanks for tuning in to Dear Cyber Sue. Today's topic is, why do some people stay in relationships that they're always complaining about? Well, this is actually something that happens to a lot of people because the biggest answer here is people don't like to be alone or they've been in the relationship so long and they're not nurturing it and evolving within the relationship. So now it's becoming tedious. It's becoming a, a complain fest about every little thing that's going on. Well, first of all, if you're in a relationship because you don't want to be alone, chances are you're going to choose the wrong person all the time. There are people that keep going through every relationship with the same monologue about what they're not happy about and it's because they're repeating a pattern that isn't working for them but it's familiar so they keep going back to something that they know the problem with this is it ends up making you sort of settle constantly for the wrong people and it doesn't mean the people are bad it's just that's not a good fit for you so you have to change this situation it's much better to remain single and be by yourself than be with the wrong person. But so many people make this mistake and then they end up sort of screwing up somebody else's life in the process because maybe that person's really into you, but you're not as much into them. And so what happens is it, it becomes a hurt fest and there's so much heartbreak that goes on all the time when you end up in this type of scenario. Another thing that happens is a lot of people are actually really afraid of commitment. So they choose people that they know isn't going to work out for them so they can say, yep, yeah, I'm free again. I, I'm not in a relationship. I'm not committed. And they just keep going about their life in this same continuous way. Well, this isn't working for anybody. And you'd be much better off if you just learned how to be by yourself and then learn how to share. You could also be emotionally detached. And when this happens, a lot of the times you don't even know you are. You just think that there's a problem with every relationship. But the common denominator is you being emotionally unavailable. And this is one of the biggest problems in, in with many couples because one person's a communicator, the other one isn't. Sometimes you're both not. You choose each other because it's another familiar thing. But the problem with that, how are you ever going to communicate? How are you going to ever evolve in your relationship with each other if you don't even know how to talk to one another? So if you're constantly complaining about the person you're with, not only does it make other people around you uncomfortable because they feel bad for your partner, it it's not a healthy place for you to be in and it's certainly not a healthy place to put your partner in. So if you're constantly complaining to everybody who will listen about what's not happening at home, what's happening too often at home, anything that makes you sort of chronically discuss your partner in a negative way, you need to reevaluate why you're with them and maybe you should be outside of this relationship. You need to really pay attention to this because it's not, it's not a good thing when you're constantly talking to people about everything you don't like, about anything, even if it's not just about your partner, anything in life. You want to come across positive as much as you can. So pay close attention. Like, be honest with yourself. Is this something that you're doing? Have people told you this over and over again? That why are you with this person if you're constantly complaining about them? Think about this. Because it's not, it's not a happy place for either you or your partner. And what are you getting out of it at the end of the day? So in a case like this, if it's continually happening to you and people are starting to tell you that you are being really negative about, about your partner, it's really worthwhile going and talking to somebody professional about it because you want to be happy in the long run. You don't want to keep choosing the wrong people in your life and not having anything in common with them, not wanting to come home to them. That's not a great way to live. So be open and honest with yourself that maybe it's time to find out why this is happening, why you're constantly complaining about somebody that you're sharing your life with because it's really worth getting to the bottom of it 
Because maybe he, maybe it's just you don't want to be in a relationship, period. And that's okay. You don't have to always be in a, in a partnership with somebody. And sometimes it's good to take a bit of a break away from it to figure out who you are. It's just something to think about. Anyway, thank you so much for tuning in today to Dear Cyber Sue. If you haven't subscribed, I really appreciate it if you could do so. Please leave your comments below and click like. I really appreciate it. Thank you.